I have a little announcement to make. So I decided to make an army of toy soldiers. Look at that pea organ. Yeah. You know, it reminds me of um, Iron Man 1, where he has that sort of fake heart that keeps him alive. And then in oh. Iron Man 2, he's able to like take it out. And then <laughs> his his wife gets it framed and says proof of that Tony Stark has a heart. Okay, fresh start. We're at Town Hall. Good job, you killed three children. Purge puppets. Oh, I really like what they've done with the place. They really have an artistic flair to them. I'd say so. You didn't explore. Yeah, I am exploring. All right, it takes time. <gasps> <laughs> Sorry, I just like to get you your bastard. goat. You are getting my goat. I don't use the scent, it gets the upper level. It's like my brain is still in Tears of the Kingdom mode. <laughs> Who's this fancy lad? Hey, check this out. Looks like you, sort of. Huh. I gotta look at this. Also, I just took this entire yeah. massive painting. Yeah. <laughs> Huge. Welcome to game. A portrait of an aristocratic boy. It pictures a beautiful boy with a peevish expression of a delicate face. Extremely peevish, vivid yeah. paintings are said to possess souls sometimes? D. Gray, the genius painter, denied all such conjectures. However, his death and the rumors about his paintings are still shrouded in a thick fog. Mm. This month's trend, stalker masks. Why did the stalkers start wearing animal masks? That's a good question. There is a huge fad. According to city historians, it was customary to wear animal masks in ancient Krat. It was one of the rituals to show off one's life when one fought the legendary rock titans. What? Huh? Yeah. You know. There's like classic. rock yeah, titans? Classic rock titans. It's troubled times of petrification disease. How about refreshing your mind with an energetic stalker mask? This item includes a spore filter to protect against the petrification disease patented by the workshop. So that kind of makes sense when you have a society with such a debilitating disease that you would have some sort of mask to cover it and or to stop the spread of it. it the pandemic all over fabulous. again. So we're going up into town hall. Into the, uh, oh. Hello there, sir. You have no idea how happy I am to see you, Mr. Stalker. Oh, wait. Is it you? It's this guy. Hello. It's a relief to see you. I found the gold coin tree. Okay. So is the tree in, in this room? Oh. Okay. We have some sort of type of roof, rooftop garden here. Oh, it has like Earth Kingdom money. Set time. Was this in the original Pinocchio story? Thing? No idea. By the way, we never mentioned this, but do you remember when we were 13 and mom read us the original Pinocchio story? Yeah. That dude, was that's super dark. All of my knowledge for the classic, yeah. That was that was insane. It's it's like she didn't know either how dark it was. And we were too old to be read bedtime stories, you know? And then she'd read this dark story, like Pinocchio like crushes Jiminy Cricket at the start and then he dies. And then Pinocchio is haunted by Jiminy Cricket's ghost for like the rest of the story. I remember him being hung from a tree, like literally hanged with his mouth gaping wide open and conscious until someone else came. And oh said, yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah he gets sorry, hanged. Man. I think he gets turned into a fish and then he almost gets like cooked by a chef or something too. I don't know. It was really weird. So this is a way to restat, basically. No. No? You can't like change your stats using Here, this? Do you wish to reset the level? Oh, that is strange. Okay, so I think if you want to you can reset all of your stats and levels once here, but then in the future, you're going to have to do it 
at this specific statue later on in the game if you want to restat. So you get one chance if you want to here. Oh, okay. And then you can do P organs or your legion arm. Anyways, let's go give this coin fruit to the lad. Oh, hold on. There's some weird stuff going on here. Well, what? Huh? <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> we're happy to have we you. We were buddy. right next to it the whole time? Stalker, please. Let's hear all the wish stones. Oh, look at all these. It's no it point. It is the worst mechanic in the entire game. It's like not worth it. And even when you use it, it takes forever to use. I might restat. Or I could go completely off elemental and go into sort of more of a dexterity build. I do like the dex weapons a lot, and the elemental weapons aren't really holding my interest. It'd be nice to wield the umbrella full time, so I might do yeah, that. I love how you're also going for the umbrella just for the, the style. <laughs> it's totally my favorite. Dump. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Would it be absolutely nuts to have like 30 mass stat? I forget what the soft cap is. I kind of like the look of this. Let's do something like that. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. That looks good to me. Okay, so there's a soft cap that you start to hit at 20 to 30 that knocks it down a little bit, but then like it still gives you a decent amount uh, going up to 40 raw stats. If you ever go above 40, that's like a hard cap to where it's like then you're like the cap is good. Oh, you know, you know, uh, Lair is on Rosa Isabel yeah, Street. Ready. Memories of a happier time, my son. I know just where to hang it in the hotel. Ah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's like, am I supposed to clap at my own painting of, of myself? <laughs> that is funny. So that, that's me in my little schoolboy outfit. Yep. I guess I could wear the schoolboy outfit in solidarity. It is the, called someone's men. And it says these clothes have been worn before. The initial M is engraved on elegant brooch. M. So was there a real boy and I'm modeled after him and he his name starts with M? That's my question. Mm -hmm. Was his name Morton? His name was Mordecai. His name was Minocchio. So I'm wondering if I came across one. I don't think I've ever unlocked a wooden door. I always just push him open. How do they have a carpeted hallway that's open to the elements when they're just rain yeah, just... yeah these chairs too they'd get so moldy i thought about that too it's kind of odd ain't it geppetto mentioned the king of puppets which yep. is confusing to me i wonder if that was nikola tesla up on his tower or if there's just a actual puppet king with like a crown i guess we'll see <laughs> Rosa Isabel Street, the entertainment district. You're coughing. And singing? I don't trust singing. <laughs> People are vibing, you know? If people are singing during an apocalypse, I don't trust. I don't trust them. It's a person, though. Clearly, oh, they're bad. Hold on, I'll get to that. Oh, there's somebody at the window. Who are you? Ah, oh, my stalker friend. They're demons. They won't give us a moment's peace. Drives a lady to drink it does. Which a proper me. tipple? I could use a proper tipple. What is a tipple? There's a, there's a wine oh, called Lable Wee. Yeah. When I was young, I'm so the best, my guy. <laughs> some left in the wine cellar at Lorenzinium. Okay, I'll go buy you wine, old yours. lady. I don't. I'm not sure if I'm of age. What the heck are you? I just your lady. I think we saw these maids in the intro. It's a bomb! Oh my god, Jesse, a bomb! <laughs> no, don't say that. Who's playing the piano? Slowly meander. Oh shoot, there's a box behind her. No! Whoa, she took out a knife. She had something in her other hand. 
Alright. Oh, what the hell are you? Oh, it's tanky. What the heck is this thing? It's the most it's terrifying thing I've ever seen. Uh, I hate him. Fire. Let's kill it with fire. Kill it with fire. Why did they make puppet babies? You ever want to take care of a kid but you don't want to deal with poop? Um. You That's basically what I had up. to do in high school. Yeah, potato booby. Mine was a bag of sugar. Yours was a potato? Uh, I never did it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Lucky you. It's because that's the worst project ever. All right. Oh, he has a gun. <laughs> <laughs> Why do they have military puppets and guns? Save lives. There was one loading screen I saw the other day that was like... It said, oh, you know, people weren't concerned when the puppets attack first happened. They're like, oh, the police will deal with it. But then they didn't realize that the puppets were the, also police. So yep. also, this thing is awesome. Can, can I say? <laughs> trying his best. He's got style. He's got grace. What's this? It's like, oh my god, it's a firing squad. I get the whole lot, lot of here. <laughs> what? Oh god, there's another one. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just slowly get these guys over here. Oh, he, he can dodge roll. <laughs> it's remarkably athletic. Oh my god. Oh lord. Yeah, I guess this is the entertainment district, which apparently means these stationary bomb guys, bomb jugglers. It makes you wonder how the economy worked with uh, the dancers, with how like puppets took a lot of like specific jobs. That's true. And, like they also took the idea of entertainers. Right. So it's like, oh, well, Imagine if no theater that? existed and it was just all robots. Oh God. This is a mess of an amphitheater. It's your deal, buddy. Oh, what a beautiful puppet you are. I can hear your springs even if you try to hide them. A lot of those friends Let's are just have an encore stuck in the air, aren't they? <laughs> performance For the of pain. red actress, Adelina Corday. I dedicate this so that's where you are. To my sister, Adelina. And I don't care. <laughs> She's very dodgy. So it seems you're a fellow sort uh, appreciator of the rapiers, I see. <laughs> very stylish. Oh, you can parry. <laughs> Take this. <laughs> what the heck? That thing stays on. Yeah, there. it's insane. The fact that she can parry me is very concerning. She doesn't do as much damage as like Elden Ring parries do, right. where it just one shots you every single time. I can't even use heavy attacks. This is a problem. Not have heals. That's all right. I'll just freaking. Yep. It's working out. Where well, was she the though? Is you get to be a lovely decoration. Dude, they're not open. Go home. Zeno. Oh, she's just standing right up there. I wish I had my she gun arm so I could just shoot her from here. I dedicate this performance to my sister Adelina. Scream a requiem for me if you would. 
This is a really weird fight. <laughs> Fighting rapier people is just hard. It's a, it's a completely different dance than anything else. You stole my sister from me, rotten puppets! Not me specifically, but I, I understand. Right. Hey. That's hard to get off of this. Oh, that's bad. Steady. You think I can drink juice while running to this boss? It's like use the controller with one hand. Yeah, of course. Okay. Well, I'm doing this one handed. We love the lack of camera. Mm. Yeah, no camera. Mm. Oh, that was a good juice. Oh gosh. That's the first time she did a red attack. Making her parry anything you throw out when she's not in an animation makes it very hard. <laughs> it's like, ah, you can't just throw out attacks. Eat lead. <laughs> 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 it just feels so juvenile, like in the middle of a duel, to just like <laughs> throw like some random junk at them. All fire and love and war. And this is love. Oh, I'm out of durability. Shoot. Hold on. Gentlemanly pause. Gentlemanly cease fire. Stop it. <laughs> She gets into our wombo combo. Hold on, do I have any more junk I can throw? <laughs> no. I'm fresh out. Woo, that was crazy. Yeah. I don't feel good about that one. I don't feel good about that one at all. Oh. Right. Sorry, the puppet throws Caminator. <laughs> Or it's like the crows from the original Puss in Boots movie that just grab Humpty Dumpty and he flies away on them after scattering like bird seed on his corpse. Classic. Hold on, there's there's a guy here. It's an auspicious lad. It'd be funny if you rested there and they just disappeared. You'd be like, what? <laughs> You're walking Truly in the gentleman. Like you must be a stalker. Can I ask you a favor? My wife's body lies on Rosa Isabel Street. Would you bring me her belongings? Then I'd have something to remember her by. <gasps> I did fetch. So her body is on Rosa Isabel Street. I laughed Isabel out loud because I was like wearing the dog mask. He used <laughs> butterfly. Bird. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Where are you heading off to anyway? I might change my arm. Oh yeah, because you get a new arm. Arm arm. Arm o arm. Arm o arm. <laughs> you can buy one arm. I'm gonna go bomb arm. This thing is huge. It's it's humongous. <laughs> Just have a pile driver on my left arm. <laughs> it's a whole jackhammer. It's a syringe for robots. <laughs> Time for your shot, Timmy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, it won't hurt a bit. I would love to like make doctor's equipment that like is specifically extra scary, even though it does the same stuff like thing as the current stuff does. Evil. I can't, like gadly needle gun <laughs> of a swing. Hmm, that's pretty fun. It takes a long time to plan it though. It's like if you plan on being a coward. Not necessarily. <laughs> oh man, this gives me fond memories of in Assassin's Creed 3, where you could plant landmines, but you could also yeah, hunt animals. Would, so you, you could drop, with it, yeah. yeah, you could drop bait on the ground over a landmine, and then a deer would come by to eat the food, <laughs> and then blow up and fly off into the distance. Yep. Good hint. Good hint. Good hint. Sounds like fun down there. Ah, uh, ah, uh, nice. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, they have rocks. What are you gonna do? Let's go back your end, That bomb takes way too long to arm. 
Who's playing music? Oh. Somebody's yeah. playing his accordion. Oh, nice. Awesome. And then you, you keep Oh, hold well on. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> hey, there's another one. Good choice. Oh. Oh, <laughs> I got the other one. Oof. Anyway. Back to the accordion. This accordion reminds me of the frogs from Flesh Delay. Oh, look, friend. You do. You knew the trap. <laughs> Yeah, I knew there's gonna be more. And that's the bad ending. Ah, okay. Hmm, you look special. We found it, the black dress. But it's just a puppet? What on earth is going on? Oh no. He thinks this is his wife? Okay, gotcha. So this explores the theme of, of people marrying puppets. It's like that guy from Gravity Falls who married his woodpecker. I don't remember that at all. The bummer is when you reference stuff like this is later, if I ever make an edit of this, I have to go back and search for that guy. And I don't want to do that. I kind of like, I, I like bringing up stuff like that because then it's like, oh, now you're forced to go back and remember. <laughs> it's like he's not significant or important in any way, shape, or form. All right, let's go uh, back to this guy. Yeah, it uh, even has the wedding ring on here. The... What a great yeah. quality of life feature. Here, sir, here's the wedding ring of your robot wife. Oh, my Melody. I should have mentioned she's a puppet, but she was real to me. I saw a shining soul inside her. I knew that she was in love with me too. Maybe I'm crazy though. Uh, time to lie. Even puppets have hearts, do they not? I mean, I have a B Perhaps organ, I guess. That's that like a heart. Just... Please, remember the love Melody and I shared. Maybe you'll find true love one day, too. Aw, oh, cute. Sad. Sad. Liar. A big fat liar. That's, fat. that's me. It'd be funny if, like, as you lie more, you become fatter and fatter. <laughs> <laughs> Like, we can't do the nose, and then, like, you start fat rolling, and, like, that's the only way for the mechanics to be implemented into the game. Absolutely insane. You unlock those, like, Dark Souls-like abilities, and it's like, I'm gonna, like, rise up in the air and butt squash. I knew that was coming, at least. I saw the ball earlier. Although, seems like somebody pushed it. <laughs> See him up there. He's he's rearing to go. Hold on. There's a lot of boys here. Some land boys too. Land boys. Hmm. How about you just step on this mine? Yeah. Oh, he's coming. Here he comes. You know what? Maybe let's. Oh, whoa. He's got a stretchy I arm. I don't like this thing. Boy. Oh, I don't like this at all. <laughs> He's dancing. <laughs> yeah, he taunts on your grave. He's very charismatic. I'll give him that. Here's a mini boss with a million guys that you have to defeat beforehand if you actually even want to have a chance of fighting the mini boss. This is an example where it's like, hey, man, there's a stargazer. Right past that guy. That just is much closer to the boss. And That's what I was thinking. Boss. I was gonna try and this go around him, and then he did a spinny move to get in front of me. He's a real good defense player. I'd love to see him play for the Patriots. For every sport, they should just have some insane thing. Like have a dude in a giant mech on the field. <laughs> I was thinking for water polo, you should have alligators. That sounds awesome. I'm down for alligator water polo. Well, you didn't get your own, girl. I will get it. <laughs> this is a lot of guys. Yeah. Oh, God. Dude, just... <laughs> Stay away. He's coming.
Oh, I. You are lucky you got that. Uh, I don't that think I'll be able that. to use it. He's right here. It's okay. You activated it. And if you want to, you could always lead him away and then come back. I guess I could fight him up here. Yeah, you can, yeah. <laughs> yeah, not much. He does too much damage yeah. for you to block that. He's fat, fat athletic. He's very athletic, but yet still fat. This guy is great. Just having a grand old time. Yeah. <laughs> I would love to fight this guy and punch out. <laughs> it feels like a punch out boss. Well, he's an arms character with like how kind of his arms extend to her. Again. Oh yeah, he is an arms character, you're right. <laughs> Stop it, dude. I still haven't gone down half as hell. Tried to block that last one. Oh no. Flex <laughs> This is a very it's impressive opera well. house, by the way. Yeah, good architecture. Yeah. I wonder if I should upgrade my umbrella. Do I have enough I power own. moons to upgrade nope. this? You're one short. Shoot. Wait, I got another sword that I picked up on the street. The dancer's sword. Yeah, that dancer's sword. I think it's a bounce. Oh, it's like a scimitar. This, this is what this one has in perks. It's very wide arcing. Yeah, you could hit so a lot of guys. Multiple guys. You get a lot of guys. Oh, I like that. Okay. It's a cool blade and good for definitely. That's really crazy. Good fabled art. Okay, that's good. The oh yes. Is, uh, ready, by the way. This feels like a mobile game. It's like, oh man. It does, doesn't it? Yep. My buildings are ready. Thanks, Clash of Clans. Everyone online agrees with you. They're all like, what kind of mobile game crap is this? <laughs> This is the Zen Garden from Plants vs. Zombies. Right, now we have to fight Mad Clown. Actually, Mad Clown was a punch-out boss. A super punch-out, I think. You just fight a big, fat clown. Damn, that did more damage than your butt, actually. <laughs> that big one. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No. Got this. Come on. Okay. Oh. <laughs> too close for comfort. Too way too close for comfort. Jeez. What a great mini boss though. Well. Welcome to the opera house. This is a fascinating place. Whoa. Very impressive. Wow. They did a good job with this one. Oh, hey. <laughs> Are you here to greet me? No, it doesn't seem like it. Ominous. Up its strings. Disruption? What is this status effect? I guess we'll see. Oh my gosh! What are you supposed to be? The disruptor. Gee, what the heck? Why did Geppetto make a spider puppet? There's like a, you know, puppeteer for like different dances on a like uh, stage, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah and you want to yeah. see spider, no. spider dances? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go up to the other balcony real quick. Oh boy. Oh. Oh. oh, oh. <laughs> 
Okay. How is that thing perpetually swinging? It, it's a robot as well. <laughs> the chandelier is our puppet? Yeah. Ah. Oh. Who are you? You're not a puppet. Well, I am. Oh, she's got wasting? I can't sing anymore. Or, uh, petrification disease. Trisha, I'm so sorry. Wait, this is Adelina. So she's alive. But yep. her sister thought she was dead? Oh, yep, specifically the woman in white that tried to kill you. Oh. This is the apple I bought from the hotel. Okay. Yeah, sure, you can have an apple. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Excellent no apple crunch apple sound. Had. There's no way to like subtly eat an apple. You can return to her later. All right. I've barely not disrupted. Jeez, dude, you're on the wire. You missed things. All right, going things. back. It's on your computer screen for like I think 15 total. Oh, seconds good, a fable, a fable catalyst. That was cool. Yeah. Now I can inject myself yeah. with heroin. Here we go. Ah, oh, that's good. All right. Well. <laughs> Mm. What truly happens in the opera house is loot. Loot yet? This blood is blood in the box. <laughs> Technique amulet, probably not too important. Oh my goodness gracious! What? What an absolute beaut! You look beautiful. Now just let me pass, all right? He's great. He's got He's got poise, and you gotta respect that. Okay. Oh wow, you really stunned him. <laughs> Just like that. Alright. Well, good, we learned this guy. <laughs> if he ever comes up again, All right then. fight him. Thank you for it, sir. Exploding pickaxe blade? Exploding pickaxe. This is definitely not a technique weapon. I bet the special ability has it so you can actually explode with it. Am I using laborer puppets that cost so much money, you ask? Because we can't have humans explode. It feels like a Cave Johnson line. That's first bottom. Gak, gak, gak. I should go use this ergo before I lose it to the swing chandelier. I love those videos where a guy wears all night armor, he's at like a con, someone fake challenges him, and then he just like dodge rolls around the person constantly. <laughs> yeah, that's good. I like the one, this edit of him like holding his hand up to his chin. Quick edits of like, oh, you know, look how hot this night is. I will say, this is one of the harder bosses in the game. It takes people a while. Okay, so I just have to run past this flaming chandelier. Also, this is kind of mean to do, because every time you have to fight this boss, you have to go past this flaming chandelier. Heads up, it's not actually that hard. <laughs> okay. I think I've only gotten hit by it once. I really just wasn't paying attention. What could be the boss of this? The king of puppets? Also, I pulled that door. I didn't push it that time. Mm -hmm. We have skills. We can push door and we can pull door. It even pull doors, you only push them until they just break it out. Am I just gonna have to watch a bad theater production? Is that the boss? It's like two hours. That's Whoa, it's boss. it's a puppet, Geppetto. And it's a puppet me! Wait, but I'm already a puppet. But more puppet me. Insane. Oh, so creepy. That's how I get up out of my chair. Oh, 
Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Puppet King really is a king. He he has fine taste. <laughs> oh. I'm not joining your stupid theater play, man. <laughs> Comical. <laughs> this guy's great. Well, that was an insane boss intro. He's got like Dr. Octopus arms. What's that? Not a dragon, but no. Multiple yeah, multiple limbs. My question. Okay. Whoa. That's cool. You are in a corner, my friend. Yeah. Um. What am I supposed to do about that? Run. He's Bye. doing like orangutan movements. <laughs> awesome. I love this dude's attacks. Yeah, he's cool. This guy looks fun. I want to enjoy fighting this guy much more than fighting the rabbits. We shall see, my brother. That's true. I may sour on it after an hour. You can go down there. It's yeah, fun. I guess. It won't instantly kill you. Ah, kill. Oh, hey, it has a. Uh... A Trinity room in here. New clothes. Oh, quartz. Oh, it's another one of these lads. Romeo, oh, Romeo. <laughs> this strategy worked before. Dodge. Was that the uh, status effect? When in shock, see. you're. Oh, you get no uh, stamina. It looks like an epic Mickey boss. This does look like an epic Mickey boss. It's just beautiful. It's just <laughs> dance. It's just a beautiful dancer. Something, something, tiny dancer. Something, something. What is this? It's a different one. <laughs> I guess that's one I have to get away from. Woo. I would have thought he would have staggered from all that, but I guess not. All right. Nice. Bombs. Hey, I've got bombs too, man. This guy's a second phase. I knew he was too easy to have a, just one phase. He looks pretty dead to me, buddy. Oh, there's somebody in there. It's Raiden from Metal Gear Solid Raiden. It's, it is exactly Raiden. You are completely correct. Wait for it. Wait for it. What? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hey buddy, it's Ryan. <laughs> Where's the Browns waiting? Dude, what the heck? It's like my evil twin brother. <laughs> Romeo. Oh Romeo. Jeez. Oh god. Oh. What is he 
then Dang, you're getting a lot of parents off on Just trying to figure out the timing. Heal! I had one Dear HP. God, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, this guy's cool. Yeah, it's literally right in front of Metal Gear Solid. Yeah, definitely that cyborg type samurai. Although he doesn't have like a samurai sword, it's like this kind of cool hooked blade. It's a puppet ripper. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So why was Raiden... So he's just in this giant mech. I have to call him Romeo though. You know, the King of Puppets reminds me of this Halloween costume I made in college. Because for the arms I had... Yeah, I was a cardboard robot. Pull you back with it. That's cool. Thanks. He's so zoomy. <laughs> he is. He is zoomy. Wait, I wonder if the puppet. Oh no, he can't bait the puppet into going across the bridge. Well, maybe you can actually. Uh, Hold oh, on. Give it a go. I really want to see this puppet get hit by the chandelier. All right, come chase me. Come on. Okay. Come on. No. <laughs> 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 okay. All right. I'm glad they backed up into it, but that's so funny, but my walking slowly. I was like, how did you barely <laughs> miss the hitbox on that? <laughs> it's tough to get close to this lanky Kong armed guy. Never mind. You freaking got his first face. Just like that. Did you just <laughs> I cannot believe you even landed that. <laughs> what is this thing? What? Stompy. That was really strange. You freaking breaking it down, yo. Nice. <laughs> breaking it down. <laughs> Never used that before. Ooh. Hmm. It's got mad thunder thighs going on. Boom, stompy. Well, that's pretty punishable. Because it makes no sense to do that move. Here he comes. Oh, he's got fire. Oh, yeah. <laughs> He just became the villain from Puss in Boots 2. <laughs> That's a super flame combo. Now, I'm going to be completely honest with you, Corbin. Oh, does that... I've never learned that move. Okay. So here's the thing. Without learning the move, you can't avoid it and not die. Um, I've known people who, like, they, like, run away for half of it, and for some reason it doesn't hit them. It's... Sometimes I'd do that and it wouldn't, he wouldn't hit me. Sometimes it would and he would hit me. I just did the thing where it's like, I would kill him fast enough to where when he's like transitioning into second phase, he takes a long time to transition into it. If I stagger him during it or I kill him fast enough with the electricity or something, I've always beaten him without that. That was both on normal game and new game plus. Gotcha. So it's a really, <laughs> it's a fascinating situation. Okay, okay. I don't think this is attempt is the one. But... I think it is. Look at that. You learned him. Oh, I'm so dead. <laughs> I had no HP. It just has a weird pattern to it. I think you can learn it. Whoa, what the heck 
happened there? Oh, I think you parried it, dude. I, I can parry that move? No. No. <laughs> 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 Yeah! Oh, come on! Ah! <laughs> yes. Shot puts. Oh, you beautiful. Shot puts come and help. He's beautiful! Kill you with that. Uh, let's try puppet strength. Rip. Also, he takes off his hat what? when you die. I've never seen that before. What? what? Since when? The temp's already dead. Well, we can learn. <laughs> now, what did we learn? <laughs> I learned nothing. I learned that this robot has an umbilical cord on its back. There's this locked door that I never opened. Oh, there's one on the ceiling. Get down from there. Them cells are too long. There is a chest down here, though. What do we have here? <gasps> Quartz! It was so worth coming back for this. Plus six. Oh no, you cannot pull him close to you. He has a big metallic body. You can cl move closer to him though. He's what is he doing? Keep breaking it down. <laughs> breaking it down like this. Break dance in this, buddy. Juice. Juice. Oh, God. <laughs> Darn it. Can't stun like crazy. Dang, you were consuming the man. His animation is super glitched out right there. He caught my jump back. Play mignon, my guy. Play mignon. <laughs> oh, he threw it and then ran to it? What happened there? Yeah. What is he this? At you, but He's never did that move. It. It's interesting. Now you're like familiar enough with his pattern to be like, okay, he's getting close to being staggered. I'm gonna start using heavy attacks now. Cool to see. I didn't think about that. No, nah, it just breaks it too quickly. It's not possible to live through that. Yeah. You need at least that. probably three perfect guards, I think, to live through that. I lived oh. through it, but that doesn't really matter. <laughs> I hate humanoid spider things. It creeps the hell out of me. It's like a centaur. Yeah, but centaurs are... No, I don't like centaurs either that much. Okay, hold on, hold on. I have a picture that will convince you otherwise. You have a picture right, of buddy. a really rad centaur? Heck yeah, I do. Oh god. What if a giraffe was a centaur? I hate Beautiful. both of them. It reminds me of like, <laughs> if a horse wore pants, would it wear it like this or like this? Yeah. It's got that, it's got that same energy to it.
cool cat. Ooh hoo hoo! The hard move, you took too, it right? on, you freaking awesome. Only one way to find out. Let's go backstage. Sick. Oof. Okay. Oh, this is <laughs> this is awful. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, good sir. Oh, hey, it's Geppetto. I'm glad you're safe. There you go. I was so scared I would lose my precious son. And you did. If it's I didn't have a million lives. But you lost him so many times. <laughs> now that the king is dead, the puppets have no leader, no direction. But the curse of the petrification disease still lingers. It's tough, but I know where you should go now. The Grand Exhibition. Rumors say the alchemists there have developed a cure. Won't you help me? Son, take this. You'll find it most useful. Let's go back to the lady we gave the apple to. I can admire the ceiling of this place. Dang, that's intricate. Whoever did the maps for this game did a really great job. Not just this zone, but all the other zones have been very well crafted. Dude, spiders remind me of what matters in life. And that is to never be turned into a smoothie by a creature. <laughs> she left her locket and a record. White lady's locket. Oh, oh so they return it to her sister. Oh. <laughs> hey, what happened to the butler? He left us a note Ooh. saying to go to the hotel. Booby. Oh, mm. we have a cutscene. Uh oh, grandma is shutting down. <laughs> grandma. We should really get you a TV. <laughs> we should get her a TV. Ain't that just the way? I'm curious what your young eyes see. Mm. Trying to steal that. Oh, 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 oh. Time to lie. <laughs> there is nothing left. <laughs> the air goes whispering. A great weapon. Got the puppet ripper. This one is cool. It's like a big mechanical scythe. Hmm. Now try the heavy attack. Such a yeah. long reach. Yeah. Okay, that's like some type of thing to hit enemies into the air. This is awesome. It's really cool. <laughs> what could he possibly have to say? Welcome, good sir. I am a puppet whose ego has awoken. I wish to dwell on the welfare of Lady Antonia. Yeah, she's not doing well. I that. adore Lady Antonia. Oh. It is a presumptuous feeling for a puppet to have. I cannot watch her die. It's too painful. It's Can true. a puppet and a human fall in love? I'm to lie again. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Here's the wedding ring. It exists indeed. An unbelievable love to be sure. With a wedding ring as its symbol. I fear even trying to pursue such a splendid happiness. I have no intention of telling her, of course. Thank you. For granting me that wisdom. Is another person playing accordion? How many people have accordions here? Enough. This dog has a saw for a head. What? He's cool. These puppets look utterly down, depressed even. That's weird, right? Oh gosh. Get Lock sword. Oh yeah. Lock sword's cool. It's like legit just a sword. But it's like the sword. Got a sick lock to it. 
Okay. Yeah. Nothing too crazy. Block someone a new one. Yes. Blocks. <laughs> you just say one liners where it's like, now it's your time to die. Guess yeah, your time's yeah. up. You're really ticking me off. I don't think you need a second chance. <laughs> Looks like you're gonna need to get a new base. <laughs> oh wait, this is the arcade. This feels like a mall that's a train station. Aww. Open this door. Oh, I can. Never mind. Need a key. <laughs> Alright, who else is gonna jump out of a window? Alright, that works too. This guy doesn't stagger as easy. Fire! Fire to start. It's cool. Woo! <laughs> well done. Oh, here's the key. Ooh, some bad overgrowth here. Guys, I think you have a mold problem. You need to check that, get that checked out. Oh yeah, you definitely have a mold problem. It's actively creating people. Oh gosh, what is down there? It's like a river of blood. Ooh, this is really bad. It's fine. Look, he's a friend. Somehow I doubt that. Big friend. Oh, this is like the the guy from before. <laughs> Ooh, your weapon's starting low on board. <laughs> it's running low on Durr. The Durr is low. No, isn't it? Okay. Weird wine basement. Oh man. Another big boy. <laughs> <laughs> He's a big boy. So what a really strange physique this guy has. Oh great. Oh I made a scene. Also there's two of them. It's like a truck, watch out. Yeah, I bet. I mean, let's just run past these guys. They're pretty darn slow. I mean, I'm slow too. Let's get indoors with the big buff guys can't get us. Let's get indoors with the big buff guys can't get us. Yeah, they can't get through. They're too jacked. <laughs> it's just funny. Ah, okay. Oh, hey, another merchant. Oh yeah, the, this weapon. Electric chainsaw. The electric chainsaw does electric damage, and the more you hit someone with it, the more the end of it spins and it does more damage. <laughs> it's such a cool idea for a weapon. It's always somebody who's died in the toilet. It's the worst way to go. Death of V's parents. Homicide. It's always trying to solve his parents' death. Basically, V is Batman. Oh, this room's all gas. But, like... He always takes hunger oh man, my every God. single time. We oh, got a God. problem. This guy. He's... This guy's dandy. This is not a good weapon to fight this guy with.
nice. We have heals. Oh, nice. Barely lives. You didn't notice this, but the monsters were actually aggro against the puppet as well. Oh, really? So technically, they could have helped too. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Is it the old woman of the oh, uh, it's the wine. venerable lady looking for some wine? It. Oh. If I had a wish stone right here, that would be really good. A healing wish stone. <laughs> Hello? Is anyone there? Calling Amy and all stargazers in the vicinity. I can oh I can talk with Benini here. Can you hear me? Really? This has to be how the King of Puppets did it. How he called to the puppets and controlled them. I can't believe you can transmit your voice through ergo waves. You'll never believe what signal I've picked up over the ergo. Cry for help. Somehow, someone survived. I'm suspicious too, but you have to investigate. Oh, thank you, young one. He's... A commemorative coin? Yeah, commemorative coin, boy. That's the worst. Freaking awesome. Commemorative coins are such a scam. I have a theory. You remember those Beanie Babies that, like, people invested their retirement savings into? Yeah. Or uh, how about the ceramic Hummel figurines that our great grandparents used to value, and now you can see a ton of them at a thrift store. Yeah, they're weird. I think they? I think so Funko Pops are our generation's garbage, where we place a lot oh, of value, and it's gonna become garbage, or it's already garbage within Funko a generation. Funko Pops have always been garbage. I never understood them. It was a fad, like for sure. the changes you're going through. Are you okay? My heavens. You look... Carl. What? What's happening? You're changing. My hair? Grew? You're becoming something more than a puppet. <laughs> Almost yep. human. Odd. You are now more human. Cat, where are you? Piano, I shall tame you. <laughs> I don't like my hair now. I'm, I must cover myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can give the commemorative coin to the butler. This is one of the originals, however. From the limited run. Oh, I got a half moonstone from that. Oh my, this is a change I didn't expect. <laughs> I'm glad you're growing, but I'm not sure what to make of this. I'm just wondering if Pinocchio like clenched really hard and then just like somehow grew a bunch of extra hair. I love that animation <laughs> joke where people do that with facial hair. That guy in Spongebob who does it with the mustache <laughs> in the Spongebob movie. I can't believe my eyes. It's almost as if something is growing out of the portrait like <gasps> oh the painting's oh, changed see? dude what the heck <laughs> huh <laughs> can i use this right now insane okay well all right people call them the alchemists of the isle their headquarters must be on an island across island. the sea. Also, since I'm more human, let's try playing the piano. Give this a shot. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most disappointing Not mechanic yet. ever. You know what this hair situation reminds me of? What? Zuko, your hair is too long. You've gone too far. <laughs> Automatic puppets and city of the future. The plan was to showcase and demonstrate the most advanced technology in Croft. But you know the rest. You can't hold an exhibition in a city that's fallen into utter chaos. And now the so you're gonna see some fun creations. Oh, whoa, look at the sentinel. Oh. Fire. He's got electricity. Oh, that's bad. He's, this guy's tricky. Cool. It's got a lot of health. Oh my gosh. Hmm. 
Lucky boy. Hold on, what's up these stairs? Ooh. Oh, it's the tram. Oh, I broke his weapon. Oh, he does less damage now. Yeah, but I don't have a lot of health. That's okay. Come back, mechanics. Oh gosh. <laughs> Sliced him clean in half. Please tell me you put a stargazer up there. Oh, there's a shortcut. And there is stargazer down there. Perfect. Welcome to the future. We're happy to have you here in the future. Welcome to the world of tomorrow! Pretty much. I like how tomorrow world at Disney, it's like, what do we do with this now that, you know, it's all doesn't make sense, because of course it's not the future. Ah, oh, let's put the first Star Wars ride we create here. <laughs> okay, how do we deal with you? Okay, it's aggressive. <laughs> It's moving weird. It's freaking nuts. <laughs> it's like the most death machine thing ever. Yeah, what it's was like, this oh, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> You're How really is good against the future. <laughs> oh, you guys. <laughs> oh, except electricity. Let's see. Alright. There's a shield guy too. This is hmm. This is a party. <laughs> oh, he won't aggro. Not great. This is such a mess. I'm just gonna run past it. Okay. balcony of clanking. You cannot swing yeah. the weapon here without it clanking. Clanking man, you to clank. Gosh, this is a nightmare. There's a shield guy up here too? I don't have to tell you, Chief. Good luck. I think I could like push him off or something, but I don't think there's anything that can push him off. Okay. Lead him back. Oh, now he doesn't care. Alright, no, he's like, can't be baited out of this. Oh, I just slipped off. <laughs> it's like such a cheap move for them to put a shield guy right I'm pretty there. sure if they. I'm pretty sure that guy weighs two tons, and if you put him on that banister, he would collapse the whole thing. There's no way that would be able to hold the weight of that giant, massive robot. Let's go to this direction for a bit. Oh, there. <laughs> Great, another one of these guys. Okay, wait, there's a ladder over here. There's a shortcut. Thank goodness. And another watchman. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. <laughs> Here he is. Whoa. Woo. All right. Whew. Strength amulet. Strength amulet. You hear that woman's voice, by the way? Yeah. Yeah. Someone's here. What's going on? Oh, hey. D don't, don't come any closer. Oh, you're not. From one. Beauty and the Beast. Are you here to save me? 
I'm a fellow. Those grand exhibition uh, jerks are not to be met. Fairy tale character. Especially after they took that drug. Then there are those biological experiments. I can escape on my own if you clear the way a bit. Shortcut. Oh, it's just a bridge. So I still, have, so I still have to go through that awful area. <laughs> Champion Victor has escaped. The great wrestler, the Hercules of Krat. He was a strong man. He was sick, but then he got cured. Somehow I doubt that turned out well. Okay, which one of you is an enemy? Yeah, then none of them are enemies. Hmm. <laughs> Get danced on. It's time, boys. Oh, now he's now he's out. <laughs> Cleaving through these guys. <laughs> of course you are. <laughs> it's always unnerving. You don't know what's what. Oh, a legion caliber. You're definitely an enemy. Yeah. <laughs> the fact that he oh, just that exploded <laughs> too. He he it's goes so to hit funny. you and then he freezes. The psych out. What it's a great so joke. <laughs> Dude, that got me so good, too. Yeah, that was awesome. Because I was like, oh, he's evil, he's evil, he's evil. And I was waiting for him to slowly activate and then attack, but then he, like, attacked and he was like, ah! And then he froze, and I was like, ah! And he blew up, and I was like, ah! <laughs> Triple psych oh, up. He's the Riddler. Another fine day in the city of Kroc. Think about this. Whatever it takes. What cannot be used before, it before it breaks? An egg? Oh, an egg. Yeah, it has to be an egg. It's an egg. In this city, there are those who wish to crack the shell. How about you? Can you wish to, to keep on hand. free of the shell that is your puppet's body? I'll reward you. All ten with fingertips of the woman of clothes. Look close before she escapes your notice. Then I'm done with you. Mostly. Hint. Behold the fingertips of the cold woman at the grand exhibition. I'm guessing that means a statue? Probably nearby, I assume. It's at the grand exhibition. He's got a submachine gun? Come here, buddy. No, that's solution. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what is this lanky looking, Waluigi looking fella? <laughs> Is this a human? It is a human. This is an alchemist. <laughs> Do anything interesting with it. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Ah, okay. Ah. Very nice. Ah. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Find it. Find the save point. Oh, God. Mega mind. <laughs> there has to be one somewhere around here. The door. No. Come on. This is not it. <laughs> this is not it. Oh man. This is like, so funny. This is positive death everywhere you look. Is it in the compartment here? No. I can use a wish stone really quick. I can't find the wish stone. God. That didn't even give me HP. Do I have the wrong one equipped? No, it, it takes a second. Okay. It slowly regenerates. 
Got another guy there. Get him. Uh -huh. That wish stone didn't even give me hardly any health. Yeah, right? It's no. useless. It's what? freaking useless. <laughs> what? Oh, this is the Armstrong dude that was in the flyer. Leave me alone, wrestler man. Find it. <laughs> Torga! Torga! <laughs> Push the button. <laughs> Excuse me, gentlemen. To do this lady's quest line who's up here. So you gotta defeat the boss of this chapter and then she'll go to Hotel Pratt. I never yeah. got her, as I didn't know she existed. Oh, oh god. god. <laughs> good job, good hops, man. He's got hops. Yeah. Oh, he's got a grab too. <laughs> Goodness gracious. <laughs> he really is a wrestler. You are not in a good position to die. Or a boxer? <laughs> He's got a drop. <laughs> this guy's awesome. Man, I killed them too fast. I'm kind of bummed. Oh well. Legion caliber, hey. There's a nude guy that travels around Hyrule and he just challenges you to endurance tests of like standing in the heat or in the cold. <laughs> nude. Or no joke, literally like dawn till dusk or dusk till, da till dawn. So you have to leave the game open while standing next to him on a pillar for like eight minutes. That's insane. He achieved sentience and then he immediately was attracted to grandmas. So I don't really know. Maybe that means sentience is a bad thing. I'm not sure. You're just jealous. <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> All right, here we are. It's the boss. I wonder who it is. All right. Also boss. guy's a real peach. Mm. He's clearly one of the alchemists, or the leader of the alchemists, I guess. Oh yeah, Welcome he jacked himself up. <laughs> you have that intro <laughs> smoke. This is where evolution becomes real. And you used it to turn yourself into a pro wrestler? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Evolution is well, he Yeah, he's got leg sweeps too. Okay. You're now gonna fight a juiced oh, up steroid pro wrestler. He's fast. Can we talk this out? You can juice. I'm fine with that. You don't have to. You don't have to fight. Oh, he's got a lot of red attacks. My goodness. This guy's ten feet tall. He's pretty. He's pretty dang big. That's a grab. <laughs> Dude. Stompies. Goodness gracious. Yeah, he, he's a he's a guy.
Oh my gosh, he can send you flying across the ring. Awesome. What a gem of a man. I wouldn't say gem. <laughs> What a pretty little thing. I don't know, man. You look pretty sickly. Plus, yeah, what's, plus what's with the tube dreadlocks? It's kind of a... Kind of not a good look. Juice him, bro. He's just... He wants to juice more efficiently. Get that juice straight to his brain fluids. This guy's like a Resident <laughs> Evil boss. Everybody in Resident Evil just loves to just turn themselves into a monster, and they're like, This is peak evolution, and I look disgusting, but this is awesome, and I'm gonna kill you, because I'm cool. He's... he's so Resident Evil, you're so right. You gotta love, like, the wrestler that, like, gives you a lecture on philosophy for, like, human evolution. <laughs> then lose the pain! Change world! I don't know, man. I think this is a good rough draft, but we have some edits we need to make to this. This is, like, the best evolution we can get. For one, work on your skin. You look pale as hell. I to keep landing those. Oh, okay. There is a second phase here. Is it gonna get even more juiced? No, oh, better than having to go through his whole health bar, you know? Juice. Is he using ergo to juice? I mean, that's what it looks like. Oh. That was like a Ross giant. The new world belongs to us. Who, who else? It's just you. Are there more juiced up people? I am the chosen one. This guy really is folk. Humanity must be oh born man, again. he is aggressive. Yeah, I am just fighting a blue Hulk. I'm not sure how I feel about this boss. I kind of like just having the big beefy dude to fight. That uses he. I love all the unique fighting moves he uses. Yeah. Oh man, <laughs> that's awesome. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> just oh. running. <laughs> oh. He's <laughs> just running in place. I only burst this guy once, but here's the thing: it took me like two tries. What? You beat this two guy in two tries. tries? Two or three tries, yeah. I don't know him. I don't know the fight. Okay. I almost feel attached you did. You're just too so, good, yeah, man. I, I love the idea of him, but I never actually got to really experience him that much. Oh. Grab his room. If you don't roll out of that, will he just stomp on your face <laughs> to death? <laughs> Maybe. Uh, I don't think so. I dedicate this for you. His voice kills me. <laughs> so that article you read earlier about famous wrestler that like went missing, that's him. Ah, gotcha. Yeah, he came down with an illness and they decided to cure him through less traditional means. Rather than chicken soup, they're like, uh, you know, freaking steroids. steroids. Zombie steroids. I am a firm believer that like one day we should have like the drug Olympics. Let's push humanity to its absolute limit. Like how strong can we physically be with the drugs? You know what I mean? And it's like it's very unsafe. And like all the participants not want to be healthy in your life if you want to pursue this. And it's and a lot of it is like the chemistry of like how much drugs can I take to boost my muscle mass without accidentally killing myself? Interesting question. Okay, this thing kind of sounds like the Star Wars theme. From like the prequels. The choir. They're from the prequels, yeah. Oh no. 
he ate Willy Wonka's everlasting gobstopper. Or what was that turn to violet into a giant blueberry? That was gum. That was gum? Yeah. I would expect the second phase to be way more aggressive. They are pretty rare. Ooh, dude. I think he got this. Wait, wait. He didn't go down. No, oh, he is. No, he did. I was down. Okay. I he has, like, a, a final, like, fist pound into the ground that you can get caught by. I thought he was just doing the bald bull and just got up. Unless he was knocked out by a star punch or something. I mean, good job not falling for it. Oh, so it's a, it's a fake out attack? Yeah. Like, he attacks as he's falling. Oh, that's cool. That's a really cool mechanic. It's very thin. <laughs> You're so weak. So unfit. So unfit. <laughs> Look, I don't work out, alright? But I don't have to, because I'm a fancy boy. It's all about technique. Oh, nice. Oh gosh, I'm shut up, Shoppa. No. Oh, oh, oh. Dude. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yes, no. Oh. See, he has a super extended attack. Yeah. Okay. Nice, dude. See? It wasn't too hard. Yeah, his second phase was a lot more tame than I expected. It's like, because he leaves himself vulnerable quite often. I am yeah. Oh. Who are you? Phase three, baby. It's, <laughs> it's the Lichyard Knight from Shovel Knight. It, it so is. I looked it up. <laughs> I saw this person. Is this B, I presume? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Let's see. Or the al main alchemist guy? I don't, I don't like that smile. <laughs> I'm surprised you defeated oh, Simon. Victor. Geppetto's creations are truly marvelous. My name is Simon Manus, a leader among alchemists. I've known your father for a long time. Geppetto didn't understand that the petrification disease can strengthen humankind. But even he can't stop such a magnificent discovery. What do you suppose our cure has created here? A lot of drugged up wrestlers. I guess I'm gonna lie. I'm gonna lie. I didn't expect you to be as rational as we are. I'm impressed, even if it's a lie. I'm sorry, I underestimated you for being a puppet. The disease does not signify death. It's the process of purifying a person's essence. Doubt it. A purified human who overcomes the purification <laughs> disease will gain a strengthened body. The essence is ergo. Yeah. No, yeah. no shocker there. The ergo you use as your power was once a human being. Huh? Our undertaking is to help others experience this purification through this elixir. We already have the means to control that power. You're welcome to come to the island and witness All right, our Alchemist Island. Hand. Or perhaps you'll make a futile effort to stop us. You feel warmth? You feel warmth. 